vacuum light. So for those of us who've been doing kind of Delta stuff for a while, you can end up with lots of small files that aren't used anymore. But for some of you out there, the idea of doing vacuum at like the end of a pipeline fills you with absolute dread because it can take 15, 20, 30 minutes to run and you want to get your data to where it needs to be. But if you don't run it, then you'll get a really bad performance. Vacuum Lite has now been bought in, um, whereas previously Vacuum did a very thorough job of going through not just old files, but like directories, clearing up empty ones of those, arbitrary files that might be there from kind of old Delta logs. Um, and that was, you know, the, the long tail of things were kind of taking the longest time. So Vacuum Lite has now been bought in. It uses the Delta log to be able to kind of whiz through all those files that aren't needed anymore. And it will be a good enough interim solution for those of you who have been spending a long time uh, waiting around for Vacuum. Okay. So Nick, where would you like to put yeah. it in our architecture diagram? Um, well, you said it's a Delta thing. Yeah, I was going to say, now that we've got AI Gateway in here, it's got like payload logging, hasn't it? So it does. Yeah, yeah, you're right. It does. I mean, let's do that. That yeah. makes sense. I, I have to do have to admit it doesn't make sense in the sense that uh, no, well, it does. I'm like the reasoning LLM where I'm bouncing back and forth uh, trying to figure out the answer. Because um, like the, the payload logging is like a append only kind of situation. Mm, no, um, no, I think it works because so if we've got provision. Eventually, you would optimize it, and then you'd want to run vacuum on it, perhaps. Okay, I like yeah. it. I'm gonna do that. So yeah, so if you've got a workspace that's got predictive optimization running on it, some of these things are going to be optimized anyway. I guess trying to think tangentially how this might occur in real life, and maybe if you had very uneven traffic to your LLM, maybe you've got like a peak time for one hour a day. Is it light? Is this correct? Is this yes, it's idea? light, as in like, like this? light soda rather than a light bulb. Yes, there we go. So yeah, so if you are using predictive optimization, um, this might even happen in the background for you. I think for most people, they're like, I don't even notice how long a vacuum takes to run and like, maybe this isn't for you. Um, but for some of you, this is going to be a real nice way to keep on top of, you know, the number of old files, the number of stale files without having to really interrupt the pipelines that you're running. Uh, I like, looks good. I'm liking this. I'm liking yeah. where we're going. I mean, yeah. Everything kind of makes sense. It wasn't as, uh, I thought we'd get a real Frankenstein, but this is all somewhat feasible.